good morning to brazil a very good morning to brazil good evening to india good day to all viewers across the country uh, almost uh, it is going to be a different type of exposure after having first conference in portugal which was in hybrid mode uh, it was a wonderful wonderful experience uh, so this is the second conference which global edu leader forum is going to host in brazil my heartfelt gratitude to all the people uh, of brazil those who have taken initiative and all managing committee organizing committee is working today just we want to highlight how it is going to be what you understood what is to be done as a process we are here to discuss pro and cons so as a first speaker uh, i would like to take dr luis uh, the mode which we have taken uh, is feasible and are you are looking for some changes i request you for 5 minutes your little insight of the previous experience and how we take this journey forward welcome to you and over to you greetings from portugal uh, esteemed colleagues esteemed friends it's a great pleasure to be here uh, it's a great pleasure to be here announcing the second conference um, after the first one so first of all i would like to thank mr sk for this outstanding endeavor that was uh, initiated some years ago of course we would like to say hello to all esteemed colleagues and esteemed friends that are here with us today namely my dear friend professor beatriz from brazil who is uh, coordinating all the efforts regarding the second conference and uh, my esteemed friends that are here today professor aceloni professor maria emilia and all the new friends of him of course uh professor rajan and all the new colleagues that are here today with us so um as um, our leader and founder has already said it was a great experience uh having a hybrid model conference in portugal um i'm sure this second conference will be even better and the third will be even better than the second So this is of course a continuous progress that um global edu leaders um, is doing and um, I think the most important thing that we have to highlight is that um, according to Mr SK's vision we are now connecting um continents countries professors researchers with the same goal that is to understand the value of knowledge the value of education of sustainability in order to create a better society for all mankind and this is our common endeavor this is our common goal this is our common objective so i think the program for this um second edition of the conference is very interesting and very challenging I'm sure it will uh, give all the participants um very interesting insights regarding um uh, tourism regarding education and regarding many other key uh, domains and areas of expertise that will be shared um by um researchers and uh, professors so um I think was, this will be a great opportunity for us all to exchange points of view and to be connected once again with the same principles that Mr SK has already mentioned so in it it is a great pleasure to be here today it will be a great pleasure to meet you again um during the the second edition of this conference and um i hope this uh, will continue and i hope this will continue has a landmark regarding a true network opportunity um between our countries in order to establish this same goal that we have that is education for all and quality education for all so thanks again for having me it's indeed a great pleasure to be here 
and congratulations to all colleagues, congratulations to the organizing committee that has been doing an outstanding work since the first edition. Thank you. Dr. Luis, you, you are the source of inspiration. Your effort uh, and uh, the first conference was a completely new experience having in hybrid mode, but it was a wonderful experience. Uh, now I would love to invite uh, Wilma who has traveled India and uh, they were there, they have experienced much more meeting students of uh, India. So she can elaborate a little more on the conference highlight. So welcome to you, Wilma, and over to you. Thank you so much. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. It's a great pleasure being part of this conference and this time here in Brazil. Last year, I had the wonderful opportunity to be there in India meeting different um, people, learning about universities, schools, and I was sure impressed by the way kids learn in a very effective way since they are really small. And I became happy because with the opportunity of being there in India, I had the chance to check that the projects that we've been trying to start here in Brazil, we are on the right way. Because what we have been starting now in India, you have been doing for many years. And I'm sure this um, conference here in Brazil will be a great chance for us uh, to show the whole world that we are worried about education. We are worried to have a better world. I'd like to congratulate Beatrice for the hard work and the entire team that we have been doing. And we invite all of you to come to Vacaria in Brazil and be part of this amazing conference. We are preparing everything the best way possible in order you have a beautiful and wonderful moments here in Brazil, like we had there in India. Welcome everyone and let's make it the best event. Of all. Thank you once again. Thank you. Thank you so much, Vilma. Indeed, it was a great pleasure for me to have you here along with Beatrice. And of course, this was not possible without Beatrice's contribution. So I would like to take Puneet here. She hosted and welcome Aditi ma'am. Uh, she was also here in India. So Puneet, I want a little more highlight how we can take to the more people in India and what was your reaction of this conference uh, which you hosted? Good evening and good morning Brazil. It's great pleasure to be part of this conference which is going to be held in the month of June. Uh, we can take more uh, learn people and who have connectivity from heart to heart. We can shortlist those people who can speak from heart and be part of this conference. So from Jammu, as we are looking for Mr. Kunal Anand, he can be part of this conference. Uh, Mr. Pramod, he can be the part of this conference. Mrs. Roini Aima, she can be part of this conference. And uh, we can uh, make them to be the part of this conference through virtual, maybe next time through physical mode also. But we can be- Yes, next, next, can... next conference is in Delhi. 25 yeah, so conferences they can... is in Delhi. I yes, announce. So there we can be the part of this conference sir so uh, uh, in uh, I, 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 I need i need endorsement of uh, dr luis and uh, beatrice 2025 yeah. will be in delhi yes 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 okay done so puneet you are going to be the mentor organizer for delhi conference along no with issue, aditi ma'am is there already right right namaskar aditi ma'am so Aditi it will be great. Huh? It will be great pleasure, sir. And these Wonderful. topics which we have for this context, they can be carried forward. And the so far, what uh, has been done on these uh, topics that can be discussed over that next uh, conference in twenty twenty five, sir. Perfect. No, you. We can uh, release the poster of twenty twenty five together. No problem. Uh, we will have <laughs> more than one year in advance. Uh, yes, Aditi, sir. ma'am, my heartfelt gratitude for your efforts doing everything, uh, being in uh, Delhi NCR. And uh, see, uh, I, I met more than 5,000 people during past COVID and then we came to the screen. Now we are filtered people, those who are keen to do that. And I wish 
if each one will take one one person those who are realistic on the ground only we make a fruitful journey i don't want just much crowd and coming on the screen and disappearing from the objective so uh, one of the outstanding uh, host for brazil guest and uh, spending more time with them that was uh, no other than vadati vasu ma'am heartfelt gratitude behalf of global editor forum i want you to head india oh along with <laughs> puneet i i have resources i will connect puneet uh, himachal jnk and as well as a uh, uh, punjab three states with you aditi ma'am what i want because the 2025 is going to be in delhi so you can host as a complete india in charge i'll be there i'll be there and the people will be there from uttar pradesh uh, from bihar from bangalore from uh, karnataka odisha from maharashtra i have people no worries about but we have to take the plan so welcome to you i i declare you are going to be the chief organizer for the delhi conference 2025 from my behalf so i, I want to take this forward just share within 3 to 4 minutes and puneet will be the vice chairperson for the hosting conference in india 2025 i will be the facilitator and wherever you want i'll be the there so aditi vasu ma'am your your two minutes experience of the past one and then we move forward again uh, arsaloni ma'am i'll be coming to you you have been very active and inspiring from the brazil so after aditi vasu arsaloni ma'am i would love to hear you hmm. uh, namaskar <coughs> good evening <coughs> good evening good morning uh, wherever you are uh so uh, this is uh, confirm something is confirm you are speaking language portuguese so what It's do okay, i do confirm 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 Pur say say yeah. confirm uh, uh, portuguese confirm. will help acha <laughs> okay okay so uh, so what i was telling is uh, i don't know what i've done and uh, i'm speaking in english because i don't know portuguese and i'll i hope i'll learn a little bit before i go to brazil brazil at least greeting and those kind of things i'll definitely go learn dia como está você these all things ah yes 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 of course and it was a great time when dr priyachis and uh, wilma came to india oh my god what a wonderful time we had and it was a festival time we had absolutely festival mood and uh, i'm sure that they enjoyed the navratra durga puja and all the festivals and they, you remember mehndi putting mehndi on the hand uh, on the karwa chauth so that was a wonderful time and they have uh, seen a plethora of indian culture and they have visited um, a school and seen the uh, work we are doing on sustainable development goals that has been uh, most uh, important aspect of gel jail has been working on sustainable development goals and 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 uh, sk singh sir or beatrice you command that thank so, you thank you so 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 <laughs> that uh, so we are we are also in the school as a partner of jail we are doing a lot of work and our school is very closely associated with jail and all our teachers were excited to see beatrice and wilma even our student teachers everyone was very excited to see them but we missed you sk singh sir uh, due to your prior commitment we really missed you <laughs> so i am i am there next time i'll be completely with you in delhi i do yes, promise yes and then we have certain uh, good universities uh, i mean in delhi and especially in noida greater noida we have very good universities private universities also who can really be uh, interested to host the event and also government university uh, gautam buddha university is a government university of uttar pradesh is a very big good university with a very huge good campus gautam buddha university we can talk to i know the vc and we can talk to sk singh sir will come go on go on, we'll go on. that will take ah, in yes. the next one okay okay and okay. now i'm planning to get a visa so finger crossed okay today is uh, <laughs> today is easter monday so i pray to jesus christ <laughs> give me the visa of brazil Oh really? I missed the Portuguese or Portugal one, so this time I don't want this. <laughs> okay, Brazil. I've been and and Doctor Luis, you book book your ticket in advance for Brazil, okay? 
So, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. SK Singh, sir, please, uh, please uh, let let us uh, decide our itinerary and uh, decide what, where where to go, when to go. Because my childhood dream after seeing Pele, Pele was our heartthrob. Okay, so <laughs> so okay. so I want to uh, want to visit Pele's country. So yeah, that's our dream. And then uh, uh, Amazon, of course, Amazon. Amazon is another uh, place okay. where I really dream of visiting. So we can uh, visit so those places. Wilma, yes. Wilma, talk to Beatrice and get the itinerary done, whatever you want to do. Yes. And now Beatrice uh, and Wilma were attending an annual function uh, in a school where I was hosting. So there was a song and they both started dancing. The Brazil name came. <laughs> With the with the yes, with the I flag, ha. Huh. I so, saw the video. With, huh, huh, Brazil flag and what was the song name? Uh, can you remind me? Boys, Venga Boys. I think I think something something Venga was boys. there. Venga, Venga yeah. Boys, Venga Boys, Brazil. Huh? La 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 la. That that. <laughs> <laughs> so in in fact, it is heart to heart connectivity, and we felt that. Arshalani, ma'am, we have been always you no know, inspiring. How about your message for this conference and what we can add? What do you suggest? Because we are coming to meet you. Well, 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 well. First, it will be a great pleasure to be you with us in Brazil next June. Vacaria and Lages. We appreciate so much your coming here. Me, especially, as you know. You will be at my house, my home, and it is a great pleasure to us to, ha to have you here in Brazil. We are not measuring any, any effort to be the second conference, a great one. Not always it is a the conference about education, but mainly, it is a conference talking about education and sustainability. Yes, I would like to greet every first broad of GEL, GEL uh, the, the group, this group that is making history around the world. Yes, since the first broad, it is extremely active and well, Words are not enough, great, gorgeous, to see what is going on here. But for sure, GEL is a very important community, yes? And it is it has a very big importance around the world in his web, Congratulate, uh, con congressing people around the world to talk about it is really important. What changes dreams into real life and for sure make possibilities to people to have a better life. That's it. We are totally ready to work hard me, Rejane, Beatriz, people that is Ember University, from Ember University, people that are connected to ABRV Institution, Institute of Education and Innovation, and ALAC, the Latin American Society and Association to support and time and effort to do it a great event. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you so much for, for the your possibility to be here. Uh, Madam Rajani is on the screen. You would like to say something about the conference, about your experience, and then I will come back to Mr. Apprizio for further talk. Welcome okay. to you and over to you. Thank you. Good morning. From here is good morning yet. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, um, I, uh, in my work, I have been um, working hard about mental health in schools with children. 
sometimes with professors, teachers, but uh, mainly about children, mental health of children. So uh, I I will our our work will, will discuss with very 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 professionals about mental health in schools. Uh, so I will. Um, especially with regard to children mental health in school context. We are talking about autism spectrum disorder, uh, oppositional defiant uh, disorder, attention defiant and hyperactivity disorder. These disorders are currently in, in Brazil, uh, at schools in Brazil. And I think uh, that it's been happening around the world. So uh, I think it's a uh, very, imp uh, very important content to discuss with other and other professionals. And I think that it will be a great opportunity to discuss about it and um, trying to find some solutions, some ways to to work with this because it's a big and important problem that we are facing nowadays. I think it's, that's it. Thank Great. you. Thank you, thank you so much. Uh, my heartfelt gratitude for all your uh, work, especially uh, uh, mental health is most important factor. Uh, nothing is possible if mental health is not good. And it is uh, in 21st century, we are in the hazard of technology where mental health is most important for happiness. Uh, should I take uh, Mr. Aprigio, tell us for further two to three minutes, what is your take? What is your opinion? What is your advice for the conference? Bom dia. Huh? Vou, talvez eu seja o único a falar português aqui, mas a professora Vilma está aí para fazer a tradução. tá? É, a gente, brevemente, né? Eu vou, a gente vai tratar... Eu, fiz, pós, eu fiz, fiz o doutorado em propriedade intelectual e a gente vai tratar sobre registro de marcas tá? e patentes. Como a, como a conferência trata de educação e, su, e sustentabilidade... Né? E, e, e eu estudo essa, essa propriedade intelectual, essa, essas marcas, né? os trademarks, as patentes, no âmbito do agronegócio. Né? Então, a gente trabalha, vai, vai, vai trabalhar a importância né? da, da proteção dos, dos ativos intelectuais no âmbito do agronegócio, no âmbito do agrobusiness. Né? E aí a gente trata exatamente sobre a sustentabilidade Tá? A, a, o, o nosso, a nossa fala ela foca no, nos procedimentos de registro, mas não só nos procedimentos, né? na importância, na relevância de proteger esses ativos, ativos intangíveis, para que as, pra que as, as, as empresas, né? para que as, as, as organizações do setor tenham... Tenha tenha condições de garantir uma, su uma sustentabilidade. Né? Esse setor para o Brasil é muito importante, porque o Brasil, um terço do PIB do Brasil é, 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 é mantido pelo agronegócio. Então, é um setor de grande relevância é, econômica, social para o país e a gente vai tratar exatamente dessa proteção desses ativos intangíveis. Tá? Era isso que eu tinha para falar. Obrigado. Thank you. I I I I I request Wilma to translate. Unmute. Okay. Samudo. Let's go. And I believe I will be his first um client because that is exactly what I need. He will be uh, then helping and teaching uh how to protect according to the law how to protect your ideas if you start a new company how can you have it as your own brand for example i have started my own company but i don't have it according to the law 
So this is exactly what he will be teaching us how to make your company, your own company. Because for example, I don't have my company according to the law. So if someone else decides to have a, a company name it like mine and the, the person um, goes to the law first, then they have my company as their company. This is what he'll be um, helping people to discover and find more about. And also um, how to protect your ideas. For example, if you have an idea about a product, then he will be teaching how can you make it uh, according to the law to uh, confirm that it is your own idea and not someone else. Thank you. Thank you so much, Vilma. So I'm coming to Brazil, give you two company. One is uh, school education completely with the new brand of global uh, uh, school and another one company global Edu leaders is always being registered. So two volunteers, Beatrice and Wilma will take care of and whatever you want to do. Uh, now uh, I request Professor uh, Ramesh Chandra, who has been always with us a number of time. Dr. Rajesh Day, get ready. Dr. Ruchi Singhala, get ready. And Professor Pankaj Srivastav, I would love to hear you. And at the end, we have Madam Maria, who has been the real driving force behind this all. So Professor Chandra, your two to three minutes of blessings, advices to the conference. Namaste. Good evening from Bhuvaneswar. Good, good evening from India. Respected President, Chairperson of the Global Leaders, Professor Eskar Singh Sir, Vice President Bethrit, invited delegates, all professors over the globe. So is the topic of giving us sustainable health, the main disease of the 21st century. It's the most important topic for the present era. In this connection, I would like to advise to the peer groups, to the delegates, to the audience, that say health is wealth. You know, health is wealth. Without the possibility of a health, good health, a person say, Personality and development and health may not be possible. So the health of this age, the diseases, many diseases follow. So one is communicable disease, another is non-communicable disease, another is psychogenic results, with mental health. So the communicable diseases that have been seen the AIDS, HIV, malaria, tuberculosis, these are the communicable diseases. And also these diseases, upon this contamination of this water, this is sexual, sexual illegal sex affairs and the blood transmission. Many ways it is transmitted. But the non communicable disease nowadays is the most of non communicable diseases. These are named as mental disorders. MR, mental disease, most of the in birth level, birth stage, due to the psychogenic pressure, stress, anxiety. That also possible by, by many causes, many constraints. So non chronic diseases, mental disorders, cardiovascular disorders, and also diabetics, hypertension, BP blood pressures, sugars, and other chronic diseases, and other diseases also, there is a non-communicable disease. This is the mental disorders, mental disorders. Now it's most important mental disorders, which is the most important to enhance the health problem, mental health. So initially I have said, Health is means how a person, how an individual possesses good health. First, it is good health possess only for satisfaction, mental satisfaction. How mental satisfaction is possible? Only psychological satisfaction. Despite of a, that is a metallistic way, metallistic way, that is the things you avoid this metallist, this is psychological satisfaction, of course. And also, you avoid the junk foods. You have the food habits. If good food habits, good good exercise, you go bam like this. So on many things. If I do timely fooding, all things that leads to this is good health. And you go the part of the life also that you go is basically important all things. So if you do this yoga regularly, exercise, workable, half an hour daily, and other things, maybe health is very good. And beside that, common disease in one of this now is five days. What is hepatitis B? Second is malaria, third is hepatitis C, and a dengue, and a fever crisis. These are five common diseases. As for the WHO, World Health Organization recommendations, 
these are the major important diseases which has a uh, non communicable disease these are these are of course due to illiteracy illiteracy about the health problems and careless attitude of the human being people of the world basically the asian countries people are suffer many diseases and beside that this is communicable disease and this is this is covid covid 19 covid 19 suffers one third people of the world one third people of the world suffers but uh, we are fortunate to have this we have prevent the covid 19 and in this connection usa china russia plays a dominant role but india dominant a prime vital role to have this is uh, prevent the spread of the covid in okay. india many farmers companies uh, invented as you see that is the vaccines and immediately that is given to the people and this is other countries people also help india so that covid we have prevented but we we prevent this massive preventive that is a disease the covid 19 but in future it may be comes again so that we should have conscious regarding the how to prevent the covid 19 or this type of disease in futures so thank you my thank advice to the audience free be care here properly health care and do your dieting properly and yoga do your yoga exercise morning work and this is mental free stress this then we prevent this type of diseases and develop the economic systems in the world thank you all thank you thank you dr chandra we will we'll take you for the detail in the specified session this is the just introductory session uh, dr dhirain kumar behra would like to hear you about little bit what is your take on the conference uh hello yeah audible audible good evening sir huh. madam uh, please pardon me that uh, <laughs> i had forgotten uh, <laughs> i was feeling doji uh, um, I will I will give you the highlight. This is the conference on education and sustainability. We are doing yes, yes. international conference, which is in going to host in uh, Brazil. India is the one of the main partner where we are planning to have it. So education and sustainability is the topic. How to take it forward? Your advice or your suggestion or your experience? Actually, in Indian context, because there is a policy of new education policy, you'll find that came into, um, it was uh, not in the recent uh, fact, I think uh, Rajiv Gandhi started this work, new education policy. This concept is going, uh, the question of uh, improving education is that we must focus uh, on interdisciplinary subject. For example, I am from mechanical engineering, did my PhD in interdisciplinary subject, industrial. How uh, education can improve? One of the factor, key factor can be, my proposed is uh, concern about human behavior. Because uh, you must, uh, uh, to educate or improve any system, we require um, to be focused Mm, not only on education, but uh, education can be in different format also. Okay. If uh, for example, physical education, okay, physical edu education can also be taken into um, consideration. So, from industrial point of view, from my background, how can I, how Got education it. can be improved? One important factor is. skill one important factor is skill skill can be different category one is your um you can uh, say uh, on skill and skill labor okay because you will find that if a uh, if a person who is uh, skilled in skill he or she is part of the system. For example, you'll find we have technical education, diploma, isn't it? So this mm -hmm. factor is sir. Uh, Dr. Dhiren, I can take uh, from you since it is just brief of topics. Uh, you okay. want to highlight technical education 
an interdisciplinary work. Right, right, so, right. right, right. Uh, very, very well said, very well said topic. We will hear you in the upcoming session once we will okay. have number of series. Yes. Last, matlab, from entire April, May, we will continue this twice in a week, thrice in a week we are planning. Okay. So we will love to hear you on that part. Uh, yes, I sir. would like to welcome on the screen if uh, Vera Pereira can speak. Welcome from India on the Global Edu Leader Forum. I wish either Portuguese or English, whatever makes you comfortable, you can bless us about the conference. Vilma, if you can speak in Portuguese and invite her. At the same time, uh, Dr. Rajesh Day, if you are here, please put your camera on and Dr. Pankaj Srivastava. Okay. So, uh, Vilma, you can take it forward. I think she was not able to understand maybe English. So, you can, Portuguese, whosoever, you can get it ready. Dr. Rajesh Day, this is the... Uh, uh, second conference of global Edu leaders forum yeah 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 i know that i know that huh. we yeah. i would uh, just let you highlight how we take it forward and how it is going to be benefited for school children so as the, well as university it's a it's a great conference actually the topic is very good that real time world is now working on the education and sustainability if i from my experience as you know that my i am an, an entrepreneur also that i'm working on that electric vehicle and, and that is also on the, on the I am I am working on the sustainability and this is the real platform and that actually the brainchild of these people like Professor Singh and uh, Betri, Asilini, these are the all known people we are last five years we are working together in different conferences so this is a great idea and I think this conference will be results a fruitful results and all will be benefited and thank me you. with my team is there for thank you thank you thank you so oh. much dr rajesh i would love i would love to take n number of students those who can contribute okay okay i will, I will can, do they, from my uh, side they can have exposure see what is missing try to understand this is not at all a profit or money making conference we never know focus. that we are doing it from three to four years little bit only the small expenditure whatever comes let them have exposure let them have an international platform because I, I still remember my childhood i was born in a village i was keen to play cricket and bully and die and all but once i went out of india i realized no things are although, different although i had a little, a little moment for two or three meetings <laughs> we have but i have a I am so what i wanted to, what i was not able to do let's create this opportunity for the students of india those okay, okay i will do from my exposure. end Find and all of the paint of batteries is my uh, arsenic all are there. So I am in the group automatically. Great, great. <laughs> Professor Pankaj Srivastava, if you are there on the screen, or I can take Madam Maria on the screen, who is the real inspiration and resource. Or Vilma, take over if any other uh, speaker wants to speak. You can speak in Portuguese and invite, I don't mind. You can translate it. Um, alguém gostaria de, de falar alguma coisa? Pode ser em português, não tem problema. Maria, Emília, alguém? Vera, gostaria de falar alguma coisa? Pode ficar à vontade. A professora Maria Emília só está com o microfone fechado, prof. Ok, ok. Ok, ok. Só vou fazer uma saudação. Uh, só for me, ver... Por inglês, uh, ok. Eh, eu come eh, to Brasil for the second conference in global a leader education. Uh, I plan to address the topics of edu education, technology, adaptive learning, inclusive education, global collaboration, and sustainable project eh, based in education. Um, I think uh, uh, I speak about the topics. Uh, I special uma saudação especial aqui ao nosso colega uh, da da FAI, professor uh, Pancaj, que está aqui presente. 
Um grande abraço. Viu? Mas traduz para mim esse finalzinho que me empolguei e não consegui raciocinar em inglês. Bom? Ok, não tem problema. Uh, she's saying special uh, greetings to Pankaj. She's really happy to see you here and everyone. And Maria Emilia, I loved your English. It's pretty good. We can understand you. So never repeat that it's it's a poor English because we can understand you. And this is the most important thing. Congratulations on trying. Thank you. Thank you so much. And Beatri, uh, I want Wilma to uh, this you know, translate in Portuguese to all. She is the big bunion tree or umbrella for us. She always saves us with the, you know, N number of things and she is the real source of inspiration behind. She has Excuse been me? the one, one, oh, uh, yes, yes, Arsulani ma'am, yeah. Yeah, we have among us, Professor Vera Pereira. It is first time she is connecting to us. Oh, she great. doesn't know everything about okay. gel. Yes, okay. and she okay. is here. Okay. Greetings to Professor Vera and she. She, she, she desires to speak something to us. Sure, sure, sure. I suppose she's gone. No, you can speak in Portuguese. Uh, Vilma will translate. Yeah. Vera, no, she's gone. She <laughs> Acha, was anyway. with us. I think it's her connection. Yes. connection. Okay, okay, yeah. okay. Yeah. So, I suppose uh, her connection. Uh, okay. can, 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 we, can we move to some other speaker who is on the screen? Uja. Hakur is on the uh, connecting point, would like to say something? Or Mr. Rohit Sain? Yeah. Mr. Pankaj once again? Yeah, okay. Excuse Mata, me, Steve. may I translate Jure. what you had sa said about Maria Emilia first? Ah, yes, yes, yes. Maria Emilia, uh, let, let me okay. translate. Oh, yeah. Maria, Madam, yeah, Maria yeah. is the one umbrella or the shed on the head, shed on the head. So we are surviving. So my heartfelt gratitude, my heartfelt respect, honor, everything. Jail was not possible. She is the one. Beatrice is working. You are working. I am working. But the real blessings which I have received, that is no other than Maria. Maria. So this is what I want to you convey this. É, Maria Emília, ele está pedindo para dizer para você que você é uma grande fonte de inspiração e que você sempre está lá apoiando e que ele está muito feliz porque todo o trabalho que a gente tem feito, você está sempre lá e com suas bênçãos, você sempre está orientando e ele está muito feliz que você sempre está por perto, nos guiando, sendo a big umbrella. E algumas coisas me faltam em português. <risos> Para vocês que conseguem entender. Ok. Ô, Vilma, pede para o SK que está faltando a Marta falar, a, um, o professor Pancage, o Guel, a Poja e a Roth. Uh. It's okay, no issue. We will we will hear them in the next because we are going to have two sessions weekly or maybe three sessions. I will discuss with the core team and I'll I'll declare the dates. I'm so day here. After maybe one more Professor Pankaj. Yes, I am here. Yeah, sir, I would love to hear you for two minutes. Okay. okay. So first of all, I would like to congratulate your team for organizing the second conference that you are planning to conduct in the Brazil. As Beatrice has already allocated the topic to me, I will exploit the topic as per my own knowledge domain, especially artificial intelligence and deep learning factor. I will exploit the topic as uh, Professor Dr. Beatrice has uh, allotted to me. Uh, at the Brazil conference, I will connect online because at that moment I'm already visiting another country. Perfect. Yeah. And once, uh, once you are going to organize a conference in Delhi, so definitely I would like to visit in physical mode. Thank you. Uh, Thank but, you so but, much. So, uh, but but uh, I would suggest that 2025 in the first week of February. Okay. Uh, the yeah. date should not be there because we have. No, no, June, days. June, June. Date will be in uh, June, June only. Is, June is okay. So, thanks once again for inviting me, for sharing my views. And all the familiar faces are already visible here uh, Dr. Beatrice, Professor Arsaloni, Dr. Maria, Professor uh, Dr. Rejane. And these are the few faces that I usually met in uh, some of the meetings. So congratulations once again to your team. Thank, thank you. you thank you. Thank you, Professor Pankaj. And heartfelt gratitude for accepting our invitation for 2025. 
uh, closing end, uh, not taking much time, let's be very specific for the time limit. We are just uh, going to connect it one hour uh, closer to that. So Beatrice would like to say something, anything. What is my say overall? Uh, this was the conference model which we started and practicing. There was a wonderful experience about the school education when Wilma was there and Beatrice was there and uh, Aditi was there. We keep sitting and discussing the topic. Trust me, trust me. It was an eye opening for me. The way uh, Wilma and Beatrice was taking the initiative notes and the ground reality. Somehow I found this let's have in Brazil and credit goes to again uh, Beatrice. So Brazil, India, it is going to be one of the combo. We will take it forward. I am not discarding a nothing. Major uh, credit goes to Dr. Luis who has taken first initiative. Even hybrid mode is going to be the most of successful uh, time those who can visit it's okay otherwise those who cannot visit they will have their topic and they will deliver more than that after conference gets over the entries work of entire discussion need to be documented and share so we will have a ebook too and this time i declare this ebook will be published on the Flipkart, Amazon and all. So anyone whosoever wants to study, they can have it. This responsibility my team will take from India. Aditi, you, me and Puneet is going to take it. Entire document after assessment, we will have a complete book publishing on the Amazon and Flipkart. So let the people get benefited. Out of this project, I want some schools, some colleges and some universities can be our brand ambassador for practicing this discussion. Otherwise, this discussion will end up at one place. And we have to go a long journey. What is going to happen after 20 years? So this is the my energy and I'm really extremely happy. Professor M.M. Goel, who has been very, very inspiring person. Uh, I welcome you on behalf of entire team of Global Edu Leaders Forum. Uh, thank you, thank you, you, Mr. Singh. Thank you. Thank if you. If you can thank bless you. us with your one Bhagavad Gita slok, will be the real blessings. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Singh. In fact, you know, uh, basically, you know, to move on the ladder of success in any walk of life, including education and uh, sustainability in all walks of life. We have to believe that Krishna's God and Arjuna as our soul is with us. And that is called Ek Shloki Gita. Yatra Yogeshwar Krishna, Yatra Parthar Dhanudhar, Tatra Sri Vijayo, Uttar Dutta, Nitra Mam. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. I would love to hear you on the specific topic. And really, you have been outstanding pure soul who has been contributing to the education. So I will take this journey forward, your wish, desire with my platform. So at Thank last, you. I want to impart this to the lower level of education where child is dreaming. Six years of age, 12 years of age, 11 years of age is a making dreams. I want this sustainability should go to that level. I want even to the KG students to practice what is sustainability and they must experience it. We are the mature people. We are ending up with some our objective of the life. We have families, we have profession, we are more uh, concerned about the bread and butter and responsibility of the family. But the small kids, I'm just uh, working on it. Uh, Aditi, I will share with you. Puneet, I will share with you. Wilma, I will share with you. Ki how we take the small ones a scribbling work, a small initiative of the 10 years, 11 years, 8 years child also. So this conference is especially conference to classroom practice. And that's what is my belief. And that's what I am aiming and dreaming for it. We can ring the bell, let the whole world get alert for it. There is something which we must take care. Either it is a health, either it is an environment, Either it is a gender equality, either it is the 17 sustainable goals, any part. See, man may come, man may go. What they will remember? Your contribution to the world. You cannot be divided with the only little boundaries which are the drawn on this earth. 
earth is one sun is one so how we can be different this is what i feel the connectivity with the brazil is one of the greatest experience of my life we started during the pandemic and whole global world become a family for all of us so beatrice with this word i do promise we take this such a small initiative to further next level thank you so much one and all those who are present in the conference those who are going to hear this on the social media and those who are waiting still to participate we will share the link you can register yourself you can put your ideas to us so we can take this journey forward we are very much open gel belongs to you all not to me at all i don't want any cap and crown on my head i want this whole world can be happy and healthy world this is what my dream is so beatrice over to you velma over to you to conclude and vote of thanks Dilma, uh, pede para ele chamar a Marta, que ela está esperando para falar. Yeah, still if someone has to... E a Poja. A Marta. Yeah, Marta. Okay. Yeah, uh, Beatriz is asking that um, Marta and Puja are still waiting. They want to say just a few words. Oh, yes, I, I, I know. I them, I... Yeah. Hello, hello. Uh, sorry for that, yeah. Because today it's a um, second day of Easter. Can you hear me? Everything yeah. is okay? Yeah, thank you so much. Yes. So I would like to thank you for this, to inviting me for this conference on education and sustainability. I noticed that the conference addresses a range of topics related especially to the sustainable development, climate change, and the education for sustain sustainability, for example. I am a specialist on electromobility, sustainable development, so I would like to thank you and congratulate to all organizing team. I think that this conference will be very interesting, so I think, I hope that in June I will come rather <laughs> online, uh, not the presence, especially due to my work. And what else? I'd like to thank you for this invitation and I hope this conference will be success. Thank, thank you, you so thank you so much. Pooja Thakur, if you are here. Okay. I invite Beatrice. Pooja Thakur is maybe busy. We close on time today, then we invite in the next one, those who have not spoken. Ele está pedindo para a gente fechar hoje e aí quem não conseguiu falar que ele vai é, fazer outras sessões para apresentação. Tá, eu vou falar em português, daí você depois fala o que eu falei aqui. Isso, eu não vou ler tudo aquilo lá, vou ler só um pouquinho. Tá? Um, thank you, thank you, professor uh, Walder. Uh, tenho gratidão eterna para a Global Edu Leaders Forum, em especial SKSAN, que acreditou que essa conferência é possível no Brasil. A UNOPAR em Anguera, Polo de Bacaria, pela parceria nesta conferência. Gratidão a todos, sem elencar nomes, mas a conferência não seria possível se não houvesse a participação da comissão organizadora. Com o trabalho árduo, dedicação ao apoio, a invocar multimarcas como patrocinador e a Câmara de Vereadores e a Secretaria de Desenvolvimento Econômico de Vacaria. Os seus esforços ajudarão a criar uma experiência valiosa para todos os envolvidos e promover o desenvolvimento econômico na comunidade. Os mais de 15 apoiadores, universidades, escolas, empresas, associações, revistas, grupos de pesquisa ou grupo de inovação para o desenvolvimento de vacaria. Obrigado a todos. So thank you so much. Catch you in the next episode very soon. Vilma, please. Yes, I'm here. I'm here. Are you closing comment. Okay, Vilma. I'm here. Just a second. Yes, yes, I'm here. Okay. Uh, so, I am grateful to the Global Edu Leaders Forum, especially SK San, who made this conference possible in Brazil. I would also like to thank you, Unopari Anguera, Paulo Vacaria, 
for their partnership in this conference. The conference would not have been possible without the hard work and dedication of the organizing committee, the support of Evocar, Moot Brand as a sponsor, and the Vacaria City Council and the Economic Development Department. Their efforts will help create a valuable experience for everyone involved and promote economic development in the community. The group of supporters comprise over 15 universities, schools, companies, associations, and research and innovation groups. Um, she says, thank you so much for everyone for, the, for their hard work and sure it will be a wonderful um, conference. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. And uh, sir, sir, one time. thing, sir, one yeah. thing I have to tell. Yeah, Dr. Diren. Yeah. Uh, one thing is that uh, that uh, rupture of the conference, uh, it should be circulated so that we can also Circulate yes, yes. to the students and other. Yes, yes because yes. I have been to recently. I have been to IIT Delhi in Great. one of the conference as a speaker. IIT Delhi probably nearer right. to your place. Mm. So, so Wilma, 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 coordinate with sir, and already Beatrice is in touch. So we send to all maximum. Okay. So that and I, uh, I, uh, I can uh, because I am in most of the time. I am visiting different uh, NITs and IITs. Great, uh, great, great. So that great. I am, I can uh, at least circulate. Particularly, why I am late? Because today was uh, in Odisha, Utkal Divas. It is right, country, right. Uh, holiday. It is a holiday. Okay. Right, right. It is not right. a working day. Though in uh, your part, it is working day. In Odisha, it is Utkal Divas. We celebrate uh, in full spirit. Okay. Uh, so that's why I was a little bit uh, tired. <laughs> Thank, you so so Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Dr. Dhiri. Uh, Beatrice will be in touch with you. We will be sharing all the details to you and you can take it forward. And I do declare uh, Dr. Dhiren uh, is already in the uh, organizing committee. Either I will propose you put his name from the Odisha. Yes, sir. Wilma, just check. So con congratulations to you. I propose your name to be the, in the thank organizing you. committee. You can you. take your inputs and other things. So thank you so much. Once and all, we'll catch you soon with the new energy, new topic and the calendar.